worked. That must mean it's live. In which case, I should do this. Warning. This program contains coarse humor and a sense of language that some people might not share. Viewer discretion is advised. But I bet that just makes you want to watch it even more. Alright. We are assuming that that worked. Because I have no reason to suspect otherwise. Alright, earlier today, I should say last episode, we unleashed a Shitnami tidal wave which completely destroyed the coastline. In this episode, we're hoping to recover from that, or at least make amends to the people of Upper Shit Creek. A very fitting name for the city considering uh, considering what happened. Yep. Very fitting indeed. So basically we need to work on building the population. Which I've kind of worked on here a little bit. Oh crap, these guys. No, they have electricity. Once again, the electrical grid is taxed. I actually get more out of these uh, green solutions than otherwise, so that should be sufficient. Oh my god. <laughs> I, I have a highlight reel, but I'm going to... Uh, highlight reel I'm going to post, which shows my reaction when this thing was flooding into the city, completely submerging everyone. Look, it's still going! Wait, holy crap! Oh, no, this is... that's the reason. Okay, yeah, the public pool is full. Uh, this is the public swimming pool. Children of all ages are encouraged <laughs> to come over here and, uh, and go for a nice swim. That looks very safe. <laughs> it's flooding the school! <laughs> That's the elementary school's public pool. <laughs> it's, uh, yeah, it's very, very sanitary. <laughs> it's like, the reason it's so full of crap is because it's next to the elementary school. The kids are peeing in the pool, I guess. Oh, I need another garbage dump. This is close. I'm just going to let it pile up. I don't care. Let the garbage pile up. And, uh, you know, it'll eventually dissipate, I'm sure. Let's see. Yeah, all we literally all we need is just housing. That's all people are interested in. So that's all I'm going to work on building here. Uh... This is going into the district of Shit Lake. I'm not sure I want to do that too much. Oh wait, this is all Shit Lake. Never mind. Who cares? Just keep building. It's uh, you know, people they pay extra to have a lakeside residence, you know. So obviously, if they're right on the lake, that property is going to be worth the most. Regardless of the contents of that lake, I mean, sure, it's sewage, but <laughs> it's open sewage. But, you know, it's a lake. Lakefront property. People will be lined up just to get uh, rock bottom prices for lakefront property, I'm sure. I should almost just keep this filled. Just turn on the drain pipe and let it let it remain full. The only thing is, I worry it's going to happen the same thing that happened to the public swimming pool, where it overflows into the city. Alright, I actually, I don't think I can build over there. Because this is reserved for industry. Alright, but yeah, this, uh, this ought to be good. Perfect. Okay. That'll work. 
Now we just fill it with green. <laughs> A public swimming pool. That's what most public swimming pools are anyway. Statistics show it's like only 30% water. The rest of it's human waste. And it's just the nature of the public swimming pool. I mean, you got kids swimming in water. Most of them do not have adequate bladder controls. I hope the audio isn't too cut out from this. It could be. How many people are messaging me on Discord? Translating standalone words. That was cryptic. All right. So, yeah, we're gonna start over here. I'm not gonna start, actually, you know what? You know what I'm gonna do? Because screw that guy, he's not gonna get electricity. Or wait, maybe, maybe he will get electricity. <laughs> Just uh, run the line over to him. One house on the opposite side of the lake. That's, that's the way to live. If you're gonna live next to a shit lake, then you're gonna live alone. All right, so we've uh, taken care of the housing demand. Now it's all industry that they want. Industry or offices. How much longer till we get offices? Oh, offices is the next one, okay. Uh, let's see, I don't wanna poison people. Yet. Build it off of here, I guess. So there's the public swimming pool. <laughs> it's still crap. Yeah. yeah, that's that's the public swimming pool. Never mind that it's full of sewage. It's an accurate representation of 90% of public swimming pools. Okay. We need more industry. I'm filling up this map. What most people would do is they would buy a square, or they buy another square, but I want to try and fill this one up 100%. If this is filled up 100%, then I know that I'm getting maximum land utilization. And that would be uh, the most advantageous. I have two people saying they're going to join in the uh, watching the live stream. According to Twitch, I have zero viewers on the live stream. Or maybe I just didn't refresh it. Oh. Hey, we have a subscriber. Who is it? Oh. It wasn't up long enough. I can't read it quickly enough. Crap. Oh well. Huh. I have a subscriber despite the fact that Twitch is showing that I'm offline. Cool. That makes uh, makes it all worthwhile. Alright. Thank you, subscriber. I think I have an idea of who it might be. Uh, I don't know how far this is going to fill. It might impact this residential area. A building has burned down. Well, that's their fault, not mine. Okay. Hey, this could connect up. Why don't I do that? We got the big industry road coming up this way, and for no reason there's just a small house that's supposed to be built there that nobody's building on. Thus ends the industry road. All right. And, uh, so, Shit Lake. All right, we got people building luxury condos along the shoreline of Shit Lake. All right, we have this mess, which it's expanding. It's never going to stop. Oh, God. <laughs> feels horrible. <laughs> I tried so hard. I tried so hard to make zero water pollution and then the whole place just flooded and I had to 
save the town by polluting the lake. Oh god. We will fix that someday. We will fix that. Either that or we'll just leave it as is and hope that someone else fixes it. Alright. Where were we? So the industry is what it is. Oh, they don't have water. I always forget to put water down. There we go. Lovely. What I really want is for somebody to build on this little plot of land there. I might actually dezone some housing just to encourage that. Uh, let's see, we got a bit of industry there. Maybe I should give this a zone as well. Um, some people say it's the heartland. Oops. I need a name for this district. Alright, so what do we have? We have shit lake, we have shit. I sense a pattern here. What should we call this district? Prospect Heights. I don't know. That's a better name for that. Prospect Heights. We have shit lake, we have shit. What about... Shitty Valley. It's part of the city, and it's in the valley. I think that works. Anyway, we did have a subscriber earlier. I think I should stick to my promises. Let me set up the dartboard over here. Time for a story of my life. Crap, where'd the darts go? This will have to work. Throw a pen, see what it hits. All right. Looks like we got a winner. All right. Ah, yes. This actually isn't the most interesting of stories. But since we have time waiting for the population to grow, I shall tell this story. <coughs> it was an early morning. A morning like any other. And uh, it was time for breakfast, so my parents gave me an orange. And so... I went into the basement where my brother was organizing some video games, and I threw the orange as hard as I could at the wall. <laughs> I don't know why I did that, <laughs> but I threw an orange at the wall, and uh, a few days passed before anybody really noticed <laughs> noticed it, and yeah, basically the wall got all sticky there. And it stayed that way for a few years because the orange had actually absorbed into the drywall. Um, so yeah, it might not be the best idea to give a kid food. Um, you know that you have an orange, you know, you give a kid an orange, they're going to throw it at a wall. Um, yeah, that's basically the, uh, the story of the orange hitting the wall. And when my parents did find it, they're like, what's this sticky thing on the wall? I'm just like, well... You know that orange you gave me for breakfast a few days ago? Yeah, that's... Uh, uh, it might not be an orange anymore. That's what happens when you give a five-year-old an orange. And expect them not to throw it at the wall. Really. Why wouldn't a five-year-old throw an orange at a wall? Just whip it as hard as they can and smash. It's cool. That's uh, one of the many stories of my life. I'm going to mark down on the piece of paper that I've read this on stream so that I don't repeat myself. Oh, Sublime Toad in the in the chat. Hello. And welcome to the 404 Guy stream of City Skylines. We have a town called Upper Shit Creek. We were up Shit Creek earlier when this happened. I don't want to talk about it. Let's, uh, we once again have a housing demand, so let's build more housing. Do the housing thing. This is a steep hill. All 
right. Hmm. Yeah, that'll work. No one said these had to be luxury houses. Although these are luxury condos along the shoreline of Shit, shit Lake. Shit Lake, that's what it's called. Luxury condos. Everybody wants one. This land is going to be the most valuable. And the public pool is doing fine. Got to build over here. Ran out of room over there, so I'm building over here now. If anyone has uh, suggestions for other video games I could play on this channel, I'm always open to hearing suggestions. I played Grand Theft Auto 4, did the uh, entire playthrough uh, last week. Now it's just slowly being uploaded to my YouTube. I had the microphone off for the most of the time on that, though. Interestingly enough, you play Grand Theft Auto 4 and... Uh, that's when the most people have subscribed to this channel. That's where I got to, uh, I think I grew from 8 to 16 subscribers just playing GTA 4 with the microphone muted. And the second I turn the microphone off, they all unsubscribe. No. They, some of them did, actually, but no. Uh, let's take a look at resources. What's available over here? Nothing. It's partly farmland, actually. Goes into forestry over here. It looks like uh, Shit Lake might actually be a forestry industry there. Oh crap! I forgot the water again. All right, we're about a thousand away from the goal. One thousand more people here, and we'll be good. Yeah, I think you are the only one there. That's uh, that's quite the honor. Yeah, I thought there was more people earlier. I wasn't sure, but I told a story of my life about the time that I whipped an orange at the wall. I was, uh, you know, I was a five-year-old kid. I got an orange for breakfast. I decided that the uh, the more valuable thing to do with an orange, rather than eating it, is to throw it at the wall as hard as you can. And, uh, yeah. The stain that the orange left on the wall, it ended up staying there for like... I think ten years. It just soaked right into the frickin', uh... Right into the drywall. And uh, that's where the lesson was learned. Don't give a five-year-old an orange and leave him alone with it. So if I ever have kids, when they're five years old, I will never give them food. I'll just throw it at the wall. Probably. Possibly. If it's a possibility, it's something I would avoid. What the hell was the point of this road here? I think I built it with something in mind and then I gave up. I'll put some businesses there. Uh, we need more industry. Oh, I could put industry along this side. I think this is more than acceptable. Right here it's next to houses, so that's... I'm weary of doing that. I think once I get offices, I'm going to put offices in there. Oh no, the lake is draining. These luxury condos are going to be worthless. I'll fix that. There. Perfect. There. Does it actually need electricity? So close. That was a waste. Anyway. There. I should shut off a couple of these. 
Look at that sewage treatment capacity. I think this is mostly equalized. Oh, that reminds me. This is the uh, elementary school swimming pool. We're going to fill it up. Make sure it's nice and topped up. So, yeah, GTA 4 was one of the ones that I played. Um, usually once a week I'll do uh, Kerbal Space Program. I call it 404 Kerbal Not Found. Uh, yeah, there's also the Minecraft uh, series, 404 Island, which uh, it's a solo multiplayer Minecraft. Nobody else has done that before because everybody else that's on a multiplayer server is playing with people. But uh, as for me, I have a multiplayer Minecraft server and I play by myself. Uh, nobody else does that, so that's what makes it unique. It's uh, called 404 Island. Of course, every single video I've done, I upload onto my uh, my YouTube channel, which is also the 404 guy, 7HE404GUI. And I'm thinking of doing some other stuff like, uh, I don't know, I might read through, uh, read through a couple of VNs or something. At one point I was trying to play uh, Hyperdimension, but it's not really one of those games that you can play on a uh, on a live stream. It just doesn't have um, doesn't have the action requirements or whatever. And aside from that, I'm not sure what people are interested. In. I wanted to do um, that was it. I wanted to do Fortnite, but uh, when I set up Fortnite and I uh, install it and everything, I open it up and it gives me this character. I'm like, I don't like this character character looks nothing like me. Not that they just don't look anything like me, but, you know, they look weird. And uh, there's no way to change the character, from what I've uh, been able to tell. So that was um, kind of the nail in the coffin for Fortnite, but I might, uh, might attempt it if I can get around the character issue. I think multiplayer would be the way to go. I would be interested in playing multiplayer if anybody knows... Uh, that was an interesting uh, multiplayer video game to play. It'd be interesting if this was multiplayer. I can only imagine. You know, you could have somebody taking care of the public swimming pool. <laughs> yeah, the public swimming pool is 98% shit. All right, we are very close to that uh, required population. I should check on uh, check on these road congestions. All right, we got a lot of congestion right there. A little bit of congestion down here. We got a big, uh, small congestion on the roundabout at the entranceway there, and uh, if you go a bit south there. We got a little bit of congestion on this uh, one roadway entering into the main residential area. I'm Scott Manley. No. <laughs> I'm Scott Peterson with the weather. I'm not allowed to use a real person's name, I don't think. Or that might offend them. Starcraft? I never heard of that. What's Starcraft? Is it like a Star Wars thing? I think I think I've heard of it, but I've never seen any gameplay. Holy smokings! This looks freaking awesome. Look at that, it's like a freaking whatchamacallit, it's leveled. Has this guy built his house yet? Come on. Look, they got industry building over here. They don't have this guy building his luxury condo. Was he too good for it? Yeah, give him some more room to work with, I guess. Alright, if I needed more residential, I'm gonna build off of this. That looks freaking awesome. Real-time strategy multiplayer. That'd be pretty cool, I think. Uh, I think the only real-time strategy game that I've played was called uh, Warzone 2100 for Linux. And it's, uh, it's very basic. I don't think it has multiplayer. But uh, yeah, StarCraft... I'd have to look into it, but it might be, uh, might be something worth, uh, worth starting up on this channel. I don't know. I could try it.
for the most part, I don't really don't really do the uh, the Twitch streams or anything for other people. I try to make it just more I'm having fun and rubbing it in other people's faces. Uh, that's what makes it uh, that's what makes it enjoyable. I think that's why most people do Twitch. Oh my god, that's gonna be so hard to clean up. Look at what that happened. Oh my god, it's only been like a year in game, but that's... Oh. It's the same water that they got in the public pool though, so if they do any kind of like testing, they can say, look, it occurs in nature. Okay. Let's build some public parks. I think these people are depressed. Build one there. And why won't it let me build up here? Slope too steep, slope too steep. Build a botanical garden? No, I cannot. Build a tiny garden? Yes, we can. Nope, nope. Maybe not. Maybe. Perfect. Alright. Bye bye. We'll see you when you switch to your desktop. <clears throat> Public park right across from the industrial park. That makes good sense. Oh, I almost forgot. Since this is right on the border of Shit Lake, we're going to put a ton of public parks in here. Really drive up the land value. Even in areas where it's not necessary. Perfect. We want the land value of Shit Lake to be as high as possible. That's only 19 cents per square meter. Oh, I gotta make sure the lake stays full. More public parks. I don't care about the garbage. I should. I think, yeah, I don't want to build another landfill. I don't care if it's going to pile up. I might improve that road a little bit. But, uh... I think for the most part, the uh, larger issue... Oops. Can I upgrade this? Oh, no I can't. There. I think by and large, the, uh, the bigger issue at play is the... Um, is the fact that's not going to go away. So I want to wait for uh, when we get this thing. And that's only 500 uh, people away. That should be easy enough. Alrighty. No electricity, obviously. No workers. I can't relocate that. The second I move this, it's not going to let me build there again. I suppose I can clean these up. I should just call this the LA River, that's what it looks like to me. And this definitely looks like it's uh, the exit to the LA River, definitely. I'm gonna build the expected roadway along here. Oh, we got bus lanes. That was the biggest waste of money, was buying that expansion pack. I'm never buying another expansion pack for this game. The, I bought the Mass Transit. Ugh. There's just no logical reason why I should have done that. I mean, you know, add-ons and uh, mods and everything, those are all well and good, but the... Uh, Yeah, the extension they did there just wasn't wasn't good in my in my uh, 
in my humble opinion. Because they, they really didn't give you anything. It gave you like a couple extra buildings and a couple extra streets and it's like... What was the point of this? Right, let's build along here. Build it to there. Oh crap, there's a cemetery in the way. Dig them up. They can't be here. Locate these. That'll be worth worthwhile, I think. Oh, look at these people. They're so sad. Now they're even less happy. Alright, that still connects. Locate this one. Crap. That sucks. Uh, oh, that'll work. I think. It'll work despite not being connected to anything, I'm sure. Uh, yeah, I'll figure out that highway, probably. That's the end of the street, anyway. Oh, shit! Shit! Ah, uh, they got no electricity now! I hope that works. There. Wow, this still doesn't loop around. Oh, he built his luxury condo! Oh, it's so pretty! <laughs> luxury condo on, uh... Luxury condos on Shit Lake. That sounds like the property value is going to skyrocket. Very solid investment. Alright, oh, it's, uh, oh shit. Lake is overflowing again. Let's turn it off. Alright, so now we've got this street running parallel to the LA River, interrupted by a cemetery, which, do we have crematorium? Not yet. Oh my god. That's going to take forever. Hold on. Let's relocate this. Uh, okay, sewage is backing up over here, so let's put the LA River... Or no, the uh, cemetery over here, where all the sewage is. No, won't let me. Oh, I can build it there. Oh no, I'm going to do a parallel road on here, though. This is a problem with city planning. You never know what to plan. Oh, this will work good. Right there. Perfect. Alright, empty this thing. Crap. Uh, turn on the swimming pool! Maybe one of these things. Quick! Fill up the public pool. Oh, that's the problem. There. Ah, look at that. Space occupied. Oh, that's why. That'll work. Perfect. All right. Don't know what I'm going to put along here yet, but it is going to be awesome. I almost guarantee. Let's uh, go free cam on this. Oop, 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 oop. There. Very agreeable. This is the Shit Creek River. Definitely not full of shit. It's clean water, which the citizens probably shouldn't drink. Still garbage problems. How many people we got? We're still 500 away and it's not growing at all. Oh, shit! Shit! What have I done? Oh, God, not again. Oh. 
The elementary school's swimming pool is overflowed. Oh crap, that's a mess. Oh, there's no good way to get rid of that. Oh, wait a minute. Yes, there is. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Uh, quick. Where can I put this? It'll connect up. We need to get the citizens drinking. There, perfect. No, right, right, there. All right, citizens, start drinking. I hope they're not actually drinking that. That would be rather unfortunate. That should help stop the flooding. It's, uh, yeah, the elementary stool, elementary, that's a Freudian slip. The elementary school students uh, apparently overfilled the pool. Oh, jeez, that's just a mess. Glad I'm not the mayor. All right. What else do we need? Well, we need more housing. We've got this, uh... We've got this whole setup here. This looks freaking awesome. Look at that. It's like friggin' levels. It looks so cool. I don't know why. It just looks cool. Um... What else we got? They have water, that's what I wanted to check. No, they don't have water. Give them some water. There we go. Middle. Hey, we're losing residents. What the hell? It's probably because they're covered in shit. Turn that off. Maybe they're getting sick from drinking that. Um, okay, fire coverage is abysmal, but good enough. Actually, let's build a little firehouse up here. Yeah, good enough. Oops. Oh well. Uh, health coverage. Also bad. Build. These roads do not connect up very well. Build a hospital there and we'll connect this uh, connect this little side street here. Alright, that's fire. This is police. Police coverage also needs assistance. We'll put it there. Oh jeez, we lost so many people there. We're back to where we started. It is so, so sad. I guess I can take a look at my transit lines. That's wow. That's actually doing pretty good. Where is it here? Zero percent of car trips are saved. That's lovely. What about this bus line? Eight percent. That's very good. How much revenue are we getting from that? Yeah, okay. All right, that's reasonable. Why am I paying eight sixteen? I thought I was supposed to be paying less than that. Oh well. I think we're getting close to our maximum land util utilization here. It's time to buy a new plot of land. I can buy it there. This is almost useless. Uh, I could buy it there, but I mean there's shit on it. So that might not be the best solution. How's this one? This one has trees and stuff. Okay. How about this one? Ooh, a lot of farmland on that one. Alright, well this one has the highway on it. I think that's going to be the better selection. We'll purchase that. Right, you really see a naming scheme uh, starting up here. Let's 
especially given the name of the city. I should turn that to two Ys, and it would make more sense. Alright, now we can build over here. And we got trains. Awesome. I'm going to do this for absolutely no reason. I really don't like this exchange that they have here. That's, uh, I don't think it's very efficient. Also, I need it to go this way as well. I'm thinking of doing a double diamond exchange. But those don't tend to work out too well. Okay. I think I got an idea, though. Here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to have this just pass over and pass over, and then we'll have an off-ramp and an on-ramp and uh, whatever. Uh, kind of similar to uh, Ontario highways. I'm thinking that'll be advantageous. I have a bad feeling. Did I leave something running? Alright, the, uh, actually... Can I leave this running? No, that's off. Okay. So the public pool is fine. And the shit lake is fine. Good. So all is well. What the hell? Oh, That's gonna devalue the lake. Oh well. Let us build over here. Now I know it's possible to pause the game and everything, but I think it's kind of the cheater method. This is exactly what summer construction looks like. Especially in Canada. Well that's uh, just an exaggeration there, it doesn't actually look like this. Traffic gets similarly strangled, though. That's a definite truth. Right, we are now preventing people from getting on once they've uh, cleared off. Hey! All right. Get rid of this whole damn thing. In about five minutes, I am going to realize that that was a horrible mistake. But uh, by then it'll be too late, so we have nothing to worry about. And that ought to work. Right, so this is what summer construction looks like. Very realistic if you ask me. They've uh, done a great job emulating that there. Here. So I'm gonna go. Like that. No, oh, that's too far that way. I think that'll work. Over here. I think that'll work. I think I can just make this straight, can I? Yeah, doing this definitely strangles your uh, strangles your city for a fairly large number of days. Look at that traffic uh, inlet there. I think if I do this, it's going to be the other half of the city. And if I build this out here, oh, I'm under over. I think this might work. And as I said, I mean, I'm going to discover that this was a horrible mistake in a couple of minutes here. Um, so stay tuned for the freak out. What direction does this go? So this one goes up. People want to go this way. Exit there. 
people want to go this way. Oh. Enter there. People want to go that way, they exit here. And likewise. Shit! There's nothing different about it, I swear. Oh, there we go. That mostly works, I think. Does that cover all angles? If you're going this way, you want to go south. Oh, wait, no, what if you want to go north? That's, uh... Oof. The people that want to go north are screwed. Just like the people that want to go south. Ah, uh, I shouldn't have done that. Hmm. This goes here, but this doesn't go here. How can I do that? Build off of that. I'm gonna build off of here. I don't want to go underground though. Underground is bloody well expensive. Oh crap. Uh, I should have researched that more. But I didn't. Okay. I might just stop the episode here because this is, um... I bit off more than I can chew, so to speak. How can I route that? People are going to want to get off of here to go south. like a giant horseshoe U-turn. Oh well. I think that's it for this episode. I've been going for about 47 minutes. Um, anyway, obviously we've bit off more than we can chew and we've caused this massive traffic congestion, which is slowly strangling the city to the best of my knowledge, uh, I guess. I mean, for the most part, I can... Uh, I can connect these back up here, I think. Well, at least help a little bit, won't it? Probably. It's uh, certainly not an ideal situation to be in. But it kind of sort of works. But not really. Anyway, next episode we will uh, figure out exactly what the hell I did wrong here and uh, how we can fix that. If you uh, enjoyed the episode, feel free to uh, follow, subscribe, whatever. And uh, yeah, I'm the 404Guy7HE404GUI and uh, this is the public pool. No one swims in the public pool. Goodbye.